you know, in Singapore, you, the best thing you can get, it's, it's hard to make a living as a writer. Um, and the best you can get in terms of prizes for writing in Singapore is the Singapore Literature Prize. Now, there's lots of money there. They, have a, they give out $120,000 to three, uh, three art forms, fiction, non-fiction, and poetry, and in each of the four languages, which means they give out 12 prizes, uh, which means uh, each person, if they win, they get $10,000. But this prize is given once every two years. So because they, uh, I think the, the feeling is that that may, may not be enough. So they do it once every two years. So effectively, if you do win a prize in literature in Singapore, you, you can get 10,000 that will last you two years. It's about 5,000 a year. And if you look at the other art forms, uh, painting of the year in Singapore by the UOB, I think it's something like 35,000. And there's photography prizes, there's uh, piano playing prizes. So a lot of the other places, they pay quite well. And I thought 5,000 was really too little. So we tried to talk to the government about Combining the prizes, you know, instead of giving 10,000 to a person, why don't, why don't you just give 60,000 to the best book? And uh, they, they didn't agree. And eventually I thought, well, why don't I just start my own prize to encourage people to write, especially fiction, especially novels. In Singapore, we have a lot of poetry, we have a lot of short stories, but very few people were writing novels, the full length, a full length novel. And so I thought, well, if I start a prize, maybe people will start writing. You know, so now the prize is, we've just finished the third year. We've uh, received uh, 49 ent entries this year. We've got lots of novels coming in. And, uh, you know, surprisingly, people said, oh, you know, nobody's going to write. But we've, you know, in the first year, we had 79 entries. Second year, we had 50-something. This year, we have 49. And uh, yeah, so yeah, so so the reason was to really make it worthwhile for people to try to write. So we gave twenty thousand dollars in the first year. Second year we gave twenty five thousand to the winner and five thousand each to three finalists. So that's altogether forty thousand in prize money. So yeah, it's it's the it's the richest literary prize in Singapore. Totally um, private, no government support.